Hello everybody. This story starts in 1961 when Mehmed introduced the SR1 steamroller. In 1967 they made a few changes, tiny changes, by just introducing uh, a direction control to it. And in 1968 they made some slight changes to the wheels. Other than that, the model has remained almost identical for 60 years. In celebration of this incredible longevity, Mallard have introduced a special edition. It's a pretty big old beast, but actually it's fundamentally got the same parts underneath and uh, the alterations are cosmetic and they're really rather nice. Uh, we've got a, a filled in wheel, just like a proper steamroller should have. A little bit of brass bling underneath with a 60 on it and uh, a really very handsome uh, canopy with some nice lettering and it's in a very uh, purposeful looking grey and it really is rather nice um, very shiny black of course for everything else and I'm gonna see how well it runs I'm expecting it to run just as well as other rollers and uh, I've got a nice trailer to pull we'll just see how that goes Now you see this little plastic tab here, this um, makes it a little safer to hold the burner, uh, but it's also the tow hook. So later on I'll be towing with that hooked on like that. So just for now I'm going to leave the plastic thing off. Uh, all the noise is the, the very noisy fan that's taking the fumes out of the kitchen. It's already dark uh, so I, I'm going to try and do my best um, in this uh, this evening. We'll see how we go. Well, that's going like uh, about out of hell here. Maybe we do only need two tablets instead of my usual three that I use for Steam Toys in Action. Of course, Steam Toys in Action is in January usually in a freezing shed. And uh, this is somewhere warm. <laughs> so let's see if I can get uh, a trailer onto it. There you go, it's capable of pulling a big heavy log. Usually usually requires a Walesco. Oh oh oh. Spoke too soon. Mm. Let's try again. Well, I'd say that's perhaps just a little bit too heavy. Oh, oh. Yeah, maybe a little bit too heavy. Um, let's take that off. I'm a bit worried about my battery, so I'm going to stop and then start again in case I lose some footage. Yeah, it's a little slow. I think it fancies a bit of running in. Uh, the fire's still lit. I just caught a flash of it. Um, so we'll see how we go. We'll just keep on trying.
So what I'm going to try and do is just adjust the throttle a bit to slow it down so it doesn't expend all of its steam straight away. Okay, too, too much I think. I think that might have to do.